Welcome to the top three. <laughs> Delete this. Delete this. No, 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 that's too good. I like, no. Michael, you Don't know what to me. do. Burn the tapes. Guys, we've known each other for a while now, so I'm gonna level with you. We didn't write an intro for this, so I'm not gonna improv one either. I'm just gonna tell you that these are the top three free-to-play TOA teams. For beginners. For beginners. Normal TOA, okay? This is not for you big boys in TOA, hard or heck. heck. Uh, but you might find some use for some of these monsters or teams in TOA Hard, actually. Yeah, that's right. So all the teams we're going to be talking about today were made with TOA Normal first timers in mind. But you'll find that, like Seppi said, a lot of these are going to transition further and evolve with you as you journey through Summoner's War. So with that being said, let's jump into our first team. That was an intro you totally lied. <laughs> Wait. Remember your roots. Stay humble. Mm-hmm. We treat have a lot your of elders options. right. Yeah, treat your elders right. We gotta pay respects to the first TOA normal farmable team that was out there, which is Beretta, Veramos, Sigmaris, Belladion, and a fifth one. Mav. Mav. Baby, that team was so dope because you had the speed lead option, you had the HP, and also these monsters were all very accessible at the time. It can still be used to this day, though maybe you could swap Veramos out for a Fran or a Lulu or what have you, but it would still function as a team today. Now for realsies though, let's talk about the first team, which is my personal favorite, which has Fran as your leader with Verd, 2A Raw Oak, Lapis, and the Water Homunculus, both of those last two are ruined on despair. And if you want to know how to ruin Vert, we have this video for you. Fran should be ideally on speed HP HP. Sometimes people put her on attack to heal a little bit more, but make sure to have enough tankiness so she can withstand the amount of damage that the other monsters do. So the idea of this team is that you're hopefully going to be keeping your opponents locked down permanently through stuns because Lapis and Water Homunculus both have an AoE on their first skill. So Raok is super helpful with that because he's constantly pulling your team and you're getting more opportunities to do that. Now Raok, to that effect, should be ruined on Violent if you have the runes to swing it. Though if you don't have a 2A Raok at all, he can be subbed out for a Lauren, a Dark Homunculus with the strip on first skill and the cooldown reset on skill three, or even a Sigmaris. If you don't have Violent Runes yet, Raok on Fatal, totally acceptable. Super, super acceptable. The second team consists of Fran, Lauren, Jean, Bird, and Spectra. There's a lot of turn rotation here, control, both attack bars from Spectra and the Provoke from Jean, not letting the other monsters use anything but their first skills. And as a recommendation, we would say to put Jean on Swift so that way you're not accidentally procking out of your invincibility, because uh, she tends to do that when it's not the right time. And you're a beginner, so you probably don't even have violence. Small tip for Spectra, if you can put him on high accuracy, that will be extremely helpful to land not only the attack bar reduction, but also the attack break on the monsters. Another thing to note is that Verd can be almost anybody. You can sub Verd out for Mav or even a Sigmaris if you have him. Since, 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 since this list is purely free to play, we like to talk about some monsters that are kind of free to play. Yeah, you might have in your box. So we've got people like Thrain, Saf. Melia, Tatu, all the components for the DOT team. Mm -hmm. One Hack, Basalt, Mantura, there are some of the classic monsters, and also there are two monsters that are extremely useful in specific floors like Tessarion for floors with passives, Camules, and Garo. And there's someone else, Neil! Oh yeah, Neil. And Neil. That's all that was on the floor. Yeah, it's not in the screen. For the final team today, we've got Lapis, the Dark Homunculus, I forgot. <laughs> Sigmaris, 2A Rogue, and 2A Spectra. We thought about putting Crow on this team, but to be honest, you already have the big damage from both Spectra and Sigmaris, and 2A Rogue offers both cooldown reduction and a consistent way to bring some defense break onto the team. That's it? That's it, that's the video. And we didn't write an intro, we didn't write a- Go do an TOA, outro. what are you still doing here? Go get those amazing rewards and maybe send me some luck, 4780. Tell us See you next week. Bye. We love you.